The Toronto Blue Jays were buzzing with excitement during Wednesday's Grapefruit League game against the Baltimore Orioles. The team was flirting with history, just two outs away from what would have been their first spring training no-hitter. The seven pitchers who took the mound combined to keep the Orioles hitless through the first eight innings, with Yusei Kikuchi leading the charge by throwing two hitless innings to start the game. The Blue Jays' bullpen continued the impressive performance, with Zach Thompson, Trent Thornton, Julian Fernandez, Matt Peacock, Adrian Hernandez, and Hayden Junger each contributing an inning. The only base runner the Orioles managed was Ramon Urias, who drew a four-pitch walk from Kikuchi in the second inning. But, the Blue Jays were determined to keep the no-hitter intact. The closest the Orioles came to breaking up the no-hitter before Luan Diaz single in the ninth inning was in the fourth inning, when Urias hit a rocket up the middle that looked destined to be a hit. However, second baseman Kevin Biggio made an outstanding diving play to stop the ball and threw to first in time to get the hustling runner out. Although it was just a preseason game, the Blue Jays were all in, and the team was thrilled at the prospect of achieving a no-hitter. Oh yeah, said manager John Schneider after the game. Oh man, it was like the regular season, we weren't saying anything. It was who can not pass out from the heat and who can not say anything about a no-hitter. It would have been pretty cool. The Blue Jays had been on the wrong side of a spring training no-hitter before, in 2000, when Pedro Martinez threw three perfect innings for the Boston Red Sox, and five relievers followed, retiring the next 18 Jays hitters. Despite the fact that it was just a preseason game, the Blue Jays were thrilled with the near no-hitter, and the team's pitchers continued to impress throughout the game. Kikuchi, who had struggled in the first inning last year, looked sensational, throwing his first seven pitches for strikes and generating five swings and misses over his two innings of work. Thompson, who had a rough first outing, bounced back with two perfect innings, striking out the side in order in the third. What did you think of the performance? Is it encouraging or worthless since it's just spring training? Leave a comment and don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel.